The story of the woman caught in adultery serves as a powerful reminder of God's limitless forgiveness and his call for us to extend the same forgiveness and grace to others. Once, in the city of Jerusalem, a crowd gathered in the temple courtyard to listen to Jesus teach. As he sat down to teach, a group of religious leaders brought before him a woman who had been caught in the act of adultery. They presented her in front of the crowd, seeking to publicly shame and accuse her. These religious leaders, filled with self-righteousness, reminded Jesus that the law of Moses commanded that such a woman be stoned to death. They asked him what he thought should be done with her, hoping to trap him into contradicting the law. Instead of responding immediately, Jesus stooped down and began writing on the ground with his finger, as if he hadn't heard their question. The religious leaders persisted in their demands, pressing him for an answer. Finally, Jesus stood up and said to them, Let any one of you who is without sin be the first to throw a stone at her. Then he stooped down again and continued writing on the ground. One by one, beginning with the older ones, the accusers started to leave, realizing that they themselves were not without sin. Soon, only Jesus and the woman remained in the courtyard. Jesus looked up and asked the woman, Where are they? Has no one condemned you? The woman replied, No one, sir. Then Jesus said, Then neither do I condemn you. Go now and leave your life of sin. With those words, Jesus showed compassion and grace to the woman caught in adultery. He did not excuse or condone her actions, but he offered her forgiveness and a new chance at life. He extended a loving invitation to repentance and transformation. This story highlights several important aspects of Jesus' character and teachings. It reveals his mercy and compassion toward those who have fallen into sin, reminding us that he came not to condemn the world but to save it. This is the end of this episode. Follow for more.